for the 1960 Aubra Festival, um, Britain and Piers were in a in a slight quandary in the fact that they were kind of missing the major piece of of the festival. There was no centerpiece to the 1960 festival, so very few months before the festival was to begin, they they came upon the idea of making an opera out of Midsummer Night's Dream, uh, and they decided themselves to write the libretto together. Uh, so here we have the two. Midsummer Night's Dream Shakespeare versions. This is the BB one and the PP one. So Benjamin Britten and Peter Pierce, and and each of them went through the text individually. It looks like they went to their different studies and they decided which bits of the play were necessary to keep and which bits of the play were redundant. They actually got rid of most of the play, including the whole of the first act. And the way they got around getting rid of the first act was to add one line to the third act of the opera, which was compelling thee to marry with Demetrius. Um, so very cleverly, they managed to put down what would have been an absolutely monstrously long opera into something that is three acts of 46 minutes, 45 minutes and 44 minutes. Um, so the main role of the opera, don't tell any countertenors this, is the role of bottom, obviously. Um, sorry, countertenors. Um, in the opera there are three different groups of people essentially there's the the fairy world of titania and oberon and then there's the lovers who are kind of a a, a high a highly uh, classed group of people and then there's the mechanicals who are six um local craftsmen and there's you know flute the bellows mender and bottom the weaver um tink the joiner um so bottom is sort of He's not the leader of the group, but he is definitely at the heart of the group and the, and the one that they all follow and the one that they all love and the one that takes the main part and the one that sort of bosses everyone around. Uh, and then as part of, of Oberon's plan to trick trick all these people, um, Titania's asleep because of the, the juice from the flower and, and Bottom is transformed into a donkey so that Titania is then given Bottom as, as a love interest. And there's some of the most beautiful music I think Benjamin Britten ever wrote was the the, the love scene between um, Titania and Bottom in the second act of The Sunlight's Dream. But I pray you let none of your people stir. I have an exposition of sleep come for me. fun playing a donkey and sometimes wearing ridiculous costumes um, and dancing around and playing and it's just the most fun and the most beautifully joyous written thing probably Benjamin Britten wrote. For me this has been one of the the joys to have done this 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 opera. I think I've done 14 different productions now um, in different places and it's taken me to some of the most wonderful opera houses in the world and to meet some of the most wonderful people I will ever meet so I'm very grateful back from the first time I did it in 2006 um, when Glyndebourne were kind enough to give a very young me the chance to um, show the world my bottom. Mm -hmm.